champion, campeon, have you ever placed your identity in what you do instead of who you are? Stay tuned. Sambona and Mzanzi, Tobela Mzanzi, Tumela Mzanzi, Bon dia, Africa de Su, Huedah, good day to all of you talented, gifted, and potentialful campeones, champions out there. My name is William George Moises, and welcome to King and Me hashtag Winning Wednesday. And I've got another winner on my left hand side, on your right hand side. He looks amazing, he looks great with the blue shirt on. Yeah. My man, Kiss. How are you doing, eh? So yeah. Blessed, bro. 100%, 100%. Blessed. So, so yeah. good to have you here, yeah. brother. And I know that God's doing incredible things Amen. in your 100%, life. And we're excited for you. Yeah. And just for what God is still going to do, the good Amen. work that He starts, He does bring to completion. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> so, bro, I'm going to pass the ball to you. Would yeah. you mind just sharing with the people a bit what's happening in your life and what God has done, is doing, yeah. and what you believe, maybe even perhaps He's still going to do? Okay. Uh, I'll start with a small testament of mine. In 2012, I had a major knee operation. Okay. On my right, right knee. Okay. So yeah, that basically I was playing sports. So like I was very big on sports. So actually, that was my, my dream. I was like soccer, rugby, whatever it was. Okay. But I was big on sports. So 2010, 2012, went to operations. So I was like, okay, this is minor setback. Mm. But uh, uh, by the grace, maybe I'll get back. I'll get healed and I'll okay. get back to sport. And then so um, a year come by. I'm still not healing from it. The second year comes back. I'm still not healing. And I'm just wondering like, God, why is this what's happening to you? Yeah. Like, what's going on? And I'm just like asking God, like, please God, like, just pull through. Even though I can just like run down the hill, like sure. that will be amazing for me. And like, yeah. Yeah, then it comes through. And so today, I still haven't healed from the knee. And I, my God, my question is always, why God? So basically, like, 2017, I just said, okay, God, you're not pulling through. Like, do you even exist? Yeah. So basically, I just said, God, just question. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I put God to the side. I'm listening, God, actually, I'm gonna do this love thing on my own. And know how that you did it by your strength. It doesn't, doesn't work. It doesn't all. work. So yeah. yeah. So hey, next it's a tinny, so here it goes, I'm doing my own thing, I'm back in the world, I'm drinking, I'm smoking, I'm having a good time. As people say, like the world is a fun yeah, place to be. Yeah, good time. <laughs> so yeah. So 2017, uh, come to the end of the year, my brother's inviting me to a uh, youth service. Okay. So I've never experienced the, the touch of the Holy Ghost in my life. So sure. it, was always, it was a new thing to me. Yeah. So I get there and like, as my uh, my brother Mungani was preaching, sure. I was at the back and I was just like, this is like, this is like taking it in, taking it in. Yeah. And the Holy Ghost just hit me there. And sure. I just fell in tears. And that day I accepted Christ for the first time. Sure. And my life is just, is just like, now I'm just full of joy, happiness. Oh, and you know, I can't, nothing better in life than that's have, have been having, that's it. That's having the Lord it. in your life. Amen, yeah. bro. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yeah. Amen. I feel that one of the primary problems, especially amongst young people, and when I say young people, I'm talking mm. about everybody under the age of 100. All right, so everyone's quali almost yeah. basically qualifying over here. One of our biggest problems is we put our identity in what we do. Exactly. So in my case, it was, you know, William wanting to be the football player. Everything, you, yeah. know, so, you know, you put all your identity in what you do, yeah. where that's not your value. Your value comes from who you already yeah, are exactly. in Christ Amen. Jesus. So we want to encourage you that regardless of what you are busy facing, regardless of what you are busy going through, man, put your identity in Jesus Christ. Christ, not in anything else, all right? Not in the way you look or yeah. the way you speak or anything like that. Put it in Jesus Christ. He's yeah. the way, He's the truth, and He's the life. And I just want to share one more thing. I said, mm. God doesn't bless your dreams, but He blesses your purpose. So come on, put everything in God and trust in Him, and then your purpose will be fulfilled in Jesus Christ. And I thank Amen. You. Come Amen. on, come on. Yeah. You got it from Casey. <laughs> he came in twice, yeah. all right, because He loves you guys, yeah, all man. right? And just know today, to every single one of you out there, just know today, Namaste, that your life matters both to God and to us.